So here I'm going to show you how to communicate with students, okay, while after they have logged into the Smart UMS. So to communicate with them through Facebook or WhatsApp is also possible, but the problem is all the communication will not be uh, documented or be archived, okay, officially. So if you have any official communication with students, it's good to use the Smart UMS. Furthermore, if you use a Facebook, you have to look for their particular account. So you need to look for the person. And sometimes the student use the, not their uh, own name, or they never mention their metric number in their Facebook name. So you cannot identify them. And if you use WhatsApp, you will face a similar problem as well. You need to look for their telephone number and things like that. So in Smart UMS, we more uh, effective. So for example, now if I want to send a welcome message to this student, so I can just go to the navigation, click on the participant. Okay, then they will show me a list of participants. So I can select which student that I want to send their message. So for example, these are the students. Okay, I can select them. And then with the student, I can send a message. I can just click send a message. Okay, so I can write a message to them. Let's say this is a message. So one is ready. So you can you can insert picture. Okay, you can click on this and do some editing of the message. Okay, just like a Microsoft Word. The next thing that you can have a preview. Okay, of the list of participants. You can remove them now if you want. And if you are confirmed this is a message you want to send to this student, just click preview. Okay, so this is a preview of the message. Then just click send. So after you see this message, you can back to the participant list. Okay, or even go back to your course.